Here are some of our younger students testing themselves at a tour tournament hosted by Demarge's Martial Arts Academy in Calgary, Alberta. We've done a few tournaments this spring and my students have been making me very proud with their effort and um, their perseverance. Sutton here came away with a second place trophy and a, or medal and a first place medal. And uh, he ca overcame um, being hurt in his first fight and won his next two fights. He's a really awesome little warrior. Now, I love contact for kids. That may sound wrong, but the reason being is I want them to have a realistic idea of what it is to fight and you know if you know fighting hurts you're less likely to jump into it for trivial matters without protective gear and whatnot and if you do like no contact fighting you never really understand if you can or cannot fight I like contact for kids because I don't like to lie to children. If a child wants to do Muay Thai and not go to tournaments, that's fine. Or if a child goes to a tournament and the anxiety gets to them and they don't want to continue, that's fine as well. And if they decide that, hey, I want to try it again, I'll let them try as many times as they want, as many times as uh, they are able to just to support them in overcoming that. And if they decide it's just not for them, that's okay. They can still train. They can still come to the tournaments and help out and just be there as part of the experience as well. Now, Daniel here, this was his first tournament, and he came away with a second-place medal. Um, he performed really well. I couldn't believe that this was just his first tournament. If you were watching him, you'd think he'd done it before. Now this is uh, Zach's third tournament, and uh, Zach is very fit, so he can um, put a lot of uh, energy into his uh, fighting. He can really put a lot of pressure on and not tire out. It's frustrating to a lot of his opponents. He had good sportsmanship. When he saw that he was overwhelming this young lady too much, he uh, slowed down. Oh, that's a nice combo. I just had to slow that one down. He slowed down and, and took it easy on her afterwards. However, if you take it too easy, you end up just being a punching bag. Now, that was a great teep, but that's why I slowed that down. He timed it really well when she had both her feet parallel so he could knock her down. Now there, he pushed more than punched. The second time he knocked her down there, though, was just a nice hook that put her over. It was, it was crisp, it wasn't a push. So, again, he's just answering with a lot of pressure, which is awesome. This is Malachi's third tournament. He's been training with me for eight months. Um, this young lady, he's sparring here, has uh, made it to WKU Worlds on Team Canada, and uh, she's really a good fighter. And they put on a good fight between the two of them, and uh, Malachi would end up getting a second place in his division. I didn't get his first fight, but uh, uh, on video because I was cornering somebody else but man he did a good job he's doing amazing for having only eight months training I can't imagine how far he's gonna go with this these tournaments are more than just fighting they're a place for children to grow and get stronger 